Hey everybody, Justin with Lucky 8 Off-Road, and today I've got a cool one for you. These are our new LED upgrade kit for the reverse light and running lights. They fit right here on the Defender. Boom! And when you put it in reverse, you can actually see what's going on behind you, giving you a ton of light. They also have an outer ring that will work as a running light. So I'm going to show you how to install it. It's going to be pretty easy, but you are going to want to take your time. And if you have any plastic trim tools, they're going to be extremely useful. So let me get the tools out and we'll move on to the first step. The first thing we need to do is pull off this little plastic cover piece. That piece is what's giving the light its finished look. These are my plastic trim tools. I like to get in right here at the top and work it that way. Be careful, you don't wanna go caveman on it. You end up cracking this housing. If your truck's trowel ridden and scratched, then you probably pop it out with a screwdriver. This is brand new, so I gotta keep it that way. I'll uh, get to work. That's the first clip. I think there's like six of them in here and I'm just gonna continue to work my way down and release them all. I'm gonna bring the camera in and show you what it looks like on the inside as we're pulling this off to give you a better idea what you're up against. Okay, you see those white clips in here? Come on, come into focus over here. There's one up top, They're all the way down. Those are coming out, but way, way in the back, there's another set of clips that are hanging on for dear life. Now that you know what you're up against on those clips, I'm gonna just keep working on this gently until it comes off. Hyper speed. Bingo. We are in the home stretch. All the hard stuff is done. All we need to do is get this wiring harness popped out of a little clip that holds it, and I'll show you in a second. Snap this light into place, wire everything up, put it all back together. A couple minutes and we'll have it done. Right here is the wiring harness that we're looking for, and it's held in with this little clip here. I should be able to just boom. Pop that right out and gently get it out of the way. I'm going to unclip it. I'm going to try to unclip it. It doesn't want to unclip. There we go. The upgraded light kit. Make sure connectors. two and then I'm gonna take that clip it back in and arrange all the wiring nicely slide this into place okay here's the light portion way it sits, they are marked left and right. It's the left side being driver on the US truck. We're gonna just slide that into place. Make sure I don't crunch any wires. That simple. Last thing we need to do is tuck this plastic piece in. Can you bring the camera? We're gonna show you how to align these clips. Got that clip right here and we want to align it in this lower hole and catch this trim piece the ones that were giving me trouble earlier right into here and here and all the way up so 
you can bring that back and they can watch me struggle to be really funny. As they say on Thomas, a biff and a bash, it never crash. There you go. I'm going to turn the lights off and show you what these things look like. There you have it. Pretty easy install. Just careful with the plastic trim pieces, unless you don't care, then rip them off like a caveman. But the end result is some extra lighting for your reverse lights. I think that's about it for today. So I will see you guys on the next one.